what a champion. What am I excited about these days? Uh, I mean, for where I live and what's going on, there's not a lot that I can be excited about. There's like some movies and games coming out that are going to be sick. I'm looking forward to April because I'm going to Harry Max Chicago show. Uh, it's the closest one to me. So I was like, you know what? Fuck it. Pull the trigger. Let's go to Chicago and see what's going on there. Uh, so that's going to be fun. In May, I get to go down to Missouri. My uh, nephew's getting married. And so we're going to go down there for the wedding and then for like a week to go travel around and look around and do some of that fun shit so that'll be cool and uh yeah that's in the next few months and then i uh, probably when i get back with that i'll be having my surgeries or i might even be having one next month actually i probably will i'll have my nose one next month i have um so your nose your nasal bones are supposed to be kind of curved so it branches out your passages i got hit in the face when i was a kid so mine's like flat so now on my left side my cartilage is all pushed over and that bone's broken so it's got a really narrow nasal passage compared to like the right so it's really hard to breathe so what i think they're going to do is they're just going to go in and like they have to re-break and shape the bone which sounds like absolute nightmare fuel and then they have to like roto shape my cartilage like a drill but uh yeah that's the first one and then the second surgery that'll probably be happening after the may trip is a gastric sleeve so essentially they're just going to take like a big chunk of my stomach out and then sleeve it and it should help me lose like a bunch of weight right away which is going to help with a lot of my like high blood pressure problems and like everything like that and my sugar problems i was told that they would probably be able to discharge me with like a third if not less of the medications i now take so that's nice the night that i hooked up with harry mac on omega that was some shit uh as you guys know it was like not too too long after my fiance had passed. And uh, so it was a really hard time that I was going through and I was drinking a lot. And uh, I was just on Omegle because like I had seen a couple of guys do it. And I was like, huh, that's hilarious. They're, you know, you can just have fun on there sometimes and whatever. And then once you get on it, you realize it's like completely different than what you see. Cause obviously people edit it. But I'm just like going through, I put my interest in and whatever music was one of them. And uh, yeah, he just so happened to pop up. That whole interaction happened and that was all like one take straight through. I didn't, I don't think he edited any of it. And uh, it ended up just being like one of them things where at first I didn't know what was going on. I was all being dumb and trying to be goofy and shit because that's how I am. And then he was talking about doing raps and shit. And I was like, hell yeah, dude, you know, all about it. And then he started <laughs> and it was way different than I thought it was going to be. Cause it was just like the most fire shit ever. Cause normally when you're like on a site, like Omegle or something, or just some kind of random chat thing. And someone's like, I'm going to rap for you. And you never seen him before. Like play, you don't generally expect the best. I mean, I don't know who it is. He might be good. He might be shit. And like sometimes I get people that like play instruments and some of them are all right and they're just starting out and stuff. So you never know what to expect. Well, for him, it was just like immediately impressive. So it was one of them things where I was like, holy shit, this guy's awesome. Uh, I'm going to keep listening. And then it just kept evolving into what it was. And once we started having like the heartfelt moments is when I think it like really set in for me how special this was because uh you know who else is just gonna be willing to do that for someone they just met like that he is because he's awesome uh sorry i'm just getting my wheel put over here and switch games real quick so i can just i can do a little bit more talking instead of focusing spilling shit all over the place 
Let's see how I can work this out. Put that there. That stays there. That goes there. This goes down. Whoop, whoop. Okay. Maybe a little higher. I wish I had a stand like this light was on for my camera. But I can't. I can pull the camera off of this one. Why did it take too long? What the hell? I can pull the camera off of that stand, but then the light comes off and it screws on, and this one pops or screws on, so I can't readily switch them. Otherwise, my camera would be up a little higher, which would be nicer, because then it would come down so you can see the uh, the wheel and such. Clip the last 15 minutes and make it a podcast. Yeah, I could. I mean, go through and pretty much do the end of NBA into the crew. Oh, I gotta plug my shifter in. What am I doing? <laughs> Why is it not loading, dude? This is ridiculous. You're being the dumb game. I just want to play you as entertainment for the people. As entertaining as it's going to be to watch me drive supercars like a jackass. If I can get this working, I don't have another one, I don't think. Pretty sure I got rid of Forza just to get some room. Yeah, he is. He's such a, just like, apparently nice person. Just, no matter what. I just don't know what the hell is going on with this. But yeah, uh, he's a, he's an awesome person. Oh, is he on Tarkov? Let's see if I can get to a chat with him. Get him in here. See if Dragon's online. Oh yeah, he is. Okay, hopefully they're not saying inappropriate shit. If they do, I'm gonna have to leave right away, but I'm gonna check something and I might be switching over to that game if so. So one second. Fuck it. Hello. Ash. Hello. Welcome to the stream, my friends. Up. Literally was talking kind of about you. Dude, so Harry Mac raided me with 556 people. Like right now? Like they were just on here. I'm at 136 right now. To Tarkov, my yeah, I was just gonna say I'll switch over because my I just set my racing rig up to play a driving game and it's not. We're getting shot at. We gotta get in.